This print shows the magnificent contrast of Japanese art. On one hand, the delicacy of cherry blossoms, but on the other, the art of war. Oh my, that was close. Oh, but come, Esther, let's go find the students, shall we? I can't wait to hear Professor Pascal's lecture on medieval Japan! Did you know samurais were as skilled swordsmen as they were poets? Mm. Well, sure I did. They also ate plenty of sushi, wasabi, and ketchup sauce. Uh, I'm not so sure about ketchup, Andy. Then why would Roland put it in his samurai hot dog? <sighs> Worst day ever! Live? Huh, that's odd. You've never been late in your life before? I know. But today, everything's been going wrong. It started when a seagull attacked my breakfast. Then my notes for history class flew out the window. Then a seagull attacked my notes. And by the time I found them, I was late to school. And to top things off, I found this in my backpack. Last night's fish hot dog. I was wondering where I left it. Now my backpack smells like rotten fish. Ah, the perfect introduction to today's lesson. Miss Baker's sudden burst of anger stems from a loss of self-control. This print, kindly lent to us by the Metropolitan Museum, shows us that samurais were famous for controlling their emotions. They could remain calm even in the face of great danger. So that's how they could hide in the shadows. No, you're confusing them with ninjas. It's a common mistake. Ah, quite so, Mr. Collins. It was the ninjas who developed the art of camouflage. Legend even has it that they could make themselves invisible. Oh, Whoa. Whoa. Unbelievable! Observe the samurai's calm gaze. You must try to emulate it, Miss Baker. For to overcome your anger is to overcome your greatest enemy. Or, in Liv's case, to overcome the smell of rotten fish, you gotta get in the shower. <laughs> Why say that again, Joker? Oh, no damage. Oh, and I hope you weren't damaged either, Miss Baker. what I needed today, a ghost. Most likely a telekinetic one. Maybe, but our biggest concern now is where to go. I don't know, but our medallions are still recharging in Miss Jones' lab. Can't do anything without them. We need to go get them, quick, to the lockers. Globu, you feel the chakras of the universe dancing inside our minds. Miss Jones, a ghost has just awoken in our school. A ghost? I've just unlocked a new feature in Globu, and now's the time to test it out. Indeed we will. Where is the ghost? It's heading down Fifth Avenue. Let's, Let's go, go, Ghost Force! Ghost Force, don't fear the ghost! Go! 
ghost was here. Sample sent to the lab for instant analysis. Nice! That new feature sure is handy. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> no worries, sis. That ghost will be inside my boo caps in no time. Whoa! I knew I should have stuck with Red Six. <laughs> it's going into booster mode. Things just keep getting better and better. On the bright side, at least it'll have a harder time staying hidden. Uh, where did it go? Fury, look out! Uh, it can come out of nowhere! Uh. <laughs> Kids, Globu's sample analysis says you're dealing with a new type of ghost! An invisible one! This means catching it will be next to impossible! Um, maybe I shouldn't have told you that. <laughs> I don't want to spoil your confidence. <sighs> this day stinks worse than my backpack. <laughs> Crush! On your left! You're at your right! Globo behind you! I'm not gonna do this all day. Spectra, go! Why are you playing around? I'm not. I'm trying to hit it. Oh no. Lobo! You do know we aren't ghosts, right? I didn't mean to do it. All I'm saying is maybe try not to shoot us. Well, at least I'm doing something, unlike you two. Hold up, miss. We know you're having a rough day, but don't take it out on us. We need a plan. <laughs> Crush, you all right? That one attack drained all my energy. I'm useless. That ghost sure is more dangerous than he looks, which does make sense with it being invisible and all. Hey, kids, figure out how to spot that unspottable ghost yet? No, but how do you expect us to when you keep bothering us all the time? Uh, I didn't mean that. I'm sorry. I understand you're stressing out, Mist, but you really need to learn to control your anger. <gasps> Actually, I know a little Zen Yoga exercise. You control my anger? To overcome your anger is to overcome your greatest enemy. You're right, Professor Pascal. What? Who? And you're right too, Ms. Jones. I'll never be able to stop that ghost if I let my anger get the best of me. Time for me to be Zen. While we kick some food! It makes itself visible whenever it's gonna attack. And your point is? I'll provoke it into showing itself. Then you attack it with your flexi boo. Yo, scary ghost! You're too scared to show yourself? Whoa! Spectral game! Flexi blast! <laughs> missed! I missed my shot! <sighs> it's okay. We'll try again. Is that all you got? I've met little level ones tougher than you!
work, kids. Our new friends' invisibility powers are going to open up a lot of possibilities for us. Think you can use it to create a cool new gadget? Totally! I could build a compact for invisible foam makeup! Or maybe even a... Huh? <sighs> Another glitch! But I changed the router yesterday! We've had quite a day, Miss Jones. Maybe you can show us one of your Zen yoga exercises? Of course! <laughs> Man, Ugh, this thing is heavy. The museum's gonna open in a few minutes, so quit complaining and move it! I'm a square! And don't forget about the geometrical art exhibit at the museum today. It'll make you realize our world is simply a series of shapes and sizes. <laughs> Especially New York City. That's right. The skyscrapers are just big rectangles. Say, Liv, do you think I should get my hair cut into a rectangle? Any way you slice it, Carla, I bet it's going to look awesome. Uh -huh. Huh? Who knew you knew about hair? <laughs> Carla really liked that. Wish I could be as smooth as you, buddy. Um, Mike, I'm heading over to the museum to check out the geometric exhibit. Wanna come with? I... I'd love to, but I promised my dad I'd, uh, organize his basketball collection by, uh, size, so I, uh, I think uh, I understand. Some other time, maybe. Uh, did I really just see that? Charlie wanted to spend the day with you. I can't do it! It's just too risky! Since I don't know anything about art, if I accepted her invitation, I'd have a 98.4% chance of saying something stupid, and an 87.3% chance of disappointing her. Add to that the 75% chance that I stutter, that gives us 492 chances out of 500 that she'd think I'm ridiculous! Uh, did you swallow a calculator or something? Mike, you gotta stop overthinking things and be more spontaneous. New ghost in town, so put some muscle in your hustle and come grab your medallions. We're on our way, Miss Jones. Good luck catching this! Eight, twenty-four, two, zero. <sighs> I'm gonna have to lower Globu's Jokari skills. Oh, right! Let's get down to business. An unknown ghost has just been detected inside the museum. The museum? But Charlie's on her way there now! Wait, if I calculate the distance divided by her walking speed, then factor in the wind resistance, she isn't even there yet. Until I factor in the time it took me to calculate all this, then she's getting there right now! Yep, but there's no time to lose. Let's, Let's go, go, Ghost Force! Charlie! Why, I 
master! Uh, did you eat something wrong, my boy? That triangle's more of a triangle, am I right? It spins every time it uses its power, so we need to immobilize it. I'll just tie it up! Flexi Blast! All distracted! You guys stop it! Split and spin! Spectral arrow! Flexi power! I've got blood! A little help, Crush! Oh, hold on! I have to take into account my shooting angle, the velocity of my fractal boo, and the boo energy's level of inertia. Computing error. The variables are too over, well, over, well, me. What are you waiting for? I'm thinking. Thinking? If I miss, Charlie will remain a prism forever. And that's one mistake I can't make. Oh, no. Don't spin again. Whoa! Systems operational. Again. What the? <laughs> You okay? I'm fine. I, I just feel a little edgy. Miss, I I didn't mean to. Crush, you've got to get out of your head before that ghost geometrizes the whole city. Miss is right. We've got to find a new angle of attack and stay sharp. Mm hmm. Huh. No offense, Miss. There's got to be a reason it's drilling in all these spots, uh, but what? We'll work that out later. Right now, I'm going to put my fist square in its face. Yuri! We figure it out now. How are we supposed to save New York, Mist, and Charlie if we don't take time to think about it? Again with the thinking. We're taking this thing down. End of discussion. No. We need to be rational, methodical, logical, Stop! and... Stop! Didn't we already have math class this morning? Now enough with your calculations and... Oh no! That's it! Now we know what those drill points are for! What's the latest, kids? I'm afraid Miss is out of action, and the ghost has turned gigantic! Gigantic? But the bow map doesn't indicate any rise in its bow energy level. Wait, if its energy hasn't changed but its size has, then there's a fairly good chance this giant ghost is just one giant illusion. Brilliant calculation, Crush, which also means that the regular size ghost must be hidden inside the giant ghost. Let us put that theory to the test. Congratulations, Crush. Your hypothesis was correct. However, the interior has geometric properties that correlate to the eye beams of the ghost. I am afraid in a few seconds, we will all be. This is not my favorite shape. Oh. Comparing its speed to ours, we have a 99% chance of failure. We don't stand a chance. No. We have a 1% chance, and if we tackle it together, we can bump that up to 2! Right! There's always a chance, and I've got an idea. You'll go first, and you'll use your flexi powers to tag me in halfway. The momentum should be enough to- Gotcha! Yuri? You called it, Crush! The real triangle is spinning right in the center! Perfect! Gotta hurry, though! You only have a few seconds! I'm halfway there! Go! Your turn, buddy!
You get an F in geometry, Cryangle! one math problem you really solved. You can thank Crush and his super analytical brain. And I thank Fury for opening my eyes. Sure, thinking's important, but sometimes you just gotta take some risks. Speaking of which... Charlie! Charlie? Mike? What are you doing here? I, um, saw there was a ghost attack and got worried for you. So I thought I'd check on you and, uh, maybe accompany you to the exhibit. Oh, that's so sweet, Mike. But I've had enough triangles for one day. Uh-huh. How about we just go to the park instead? I've got so much to tell you about the attack! Do you know I saw Crush? I even got to talk to him!